right, Bob Chick from my go-to source. We're back here backstage. Fuad Abiyah just crowned the winner, my friend. An emotional speech up there. You got your team with you. They're all here in attendance. How'd you feel coming into this one? I felt good, man. It's been a long prep. Like, I mean, honestly, there's nothing worse for me in a prep than coasting. I like kind of getting ready and then just burning through the prep and burning, getting off the weight and getting on stage. And uh, we started at 10 weeks out from FIBO. Right. And I actually got ready pretty quick, so we were kind of coasting into FIBO, and then FIBO got canceled. And I'm like, shit. So I actually gained about 20 pounds while I was away at FIBO at the expo. When I got back, John Meadows is training me, and he's like, listen, we can do it. He's like, just get your ass on the cardio, drop your carbs. And that's what we did, man. I'm two a days, carbs were gone. I suffered through it, man. I, I was sick. I was mentally not focused. My wife is like, look, man, don't be a pussy. Just <laughs> just do what you got to do. This is your job, right? And that's that's how she talks to me, and that's what I need sometimes, right? So, I mean, I, I did what I had to do, and I got here, man. And I, I probably could have been a little bit sharper, but I'm pretty happy with the package I brought because there's some improvements there. And I think if I can come in a little bit sharper with those improvements, it'll be even better. Well, we saw you in runner-up last year at the Europa, and that was a hard-fought battle. Branch Warren coming out on top. Obviously, anytime you're losing to Branch Warren, you know you're still doing pretty good. But uh, you were fighting some illness then. I mean, so you weren't definitely weren't 100 percent, but you eked it out. Uh, so this time around, I'm, I'm guessing things went a little bit better for you. Yeah, yeah. No, there's no there are no illnesses. I mean, there's like there's hiccups, like FIBO is a hiccup. Uh, I think I had a cold like eight weeks out, but no. Overall, no excuses. Uh, it was a long prep, but no, nothing really. There's no excuses. I could, I could have been sharper, uh, and that's just my own, my own job to do. You know, I just got to work a little bit harder next time. But uh, I mean, it's been great. I had support of my friends. I had support of my wife. I got SciTech uh, has been behind me 100% the whole way through. I really couldn't ask for anything better this year. It just kind of all the pieces fell into place, and and this was the right show to do. Well, you could have been sharper, but I guess anybody could say that. But you were sharp enough to win. That's the thing that was important for us. Now you got the Olympia qualification. Uh, are we going to see you on stage again until the Olympia, or are you just you throwing all that eggs into that Las Vegas basket? I'm really not sure. You know what? I've been asked this question over and over again, and I'm not sure if I want to do, you know, Culver City and Toronto or look, look kind of appealing, especially Toronto being in my backyard. Um, but I haven't done the Olympia since 2008, and I really want to be my best ever if I do it, which I'm planning on doing it so i might just really hold off i might hold off and just show up there the best i can possibly show up has it been seven years since you've been on the olympia stage i qualified in wow. 2008 and i did it and i was definitely was too small i was only 27 years old or something like that 28 um and then i qualified in 09 and 10 but i was like hey, i'll do it the year after i'm not ready yet because i'm not big enough right. i just didn't want to take last again sure. But then they're like, now you got to win a show. And I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> so, so it's wow. been a while, yeah. and now I finally want a show. So I'm like, okay, I can get back over there. So. All right. Now we're back in, in, in a good spot. I guarantee you, you're probably not going to be last there, which is always a good thing. But it's the Olympia, best of the best. And you are truly one of the best of the best, my friend. Congratulations, Fouad. We'll see you in Las Vegas, Nevada, on the Olympia stage.